The Kaaba, a journey of faith, unity, and spiritual renewal. In the heart of the vast Arabian desert, where the golden sands stretch endlessly and the scorching sun casts its relentless gaze, stands the Kaaba, a structure that has long captured the hearts and souls of countless believers. This ancient edifice, nestled within the holy city of Mecca, is a profound symbol of faith, unity, and devotion for over a billion Muslims worldwide. The story of the Kaaba is deeply intertwined with the lives of the prophets Ibrahim, Abraham, and his son Ismail, Ishmael, whose unwavering faith and dedication to the one true God laid the foundation for what would become the holiest site in Islam. Ibrahim, revered in Islam, Christianity, and Judaism, is celebrated as a paragon of monotheism. His journey to monotheism was a path of divine revelation and profound spiritual insight. According to Islamic tradition, Ibrahim received a command from Allah to build a house of worship, a sanctuary where the name of the one and only God would be glorified. This command was not just a call to construct a physical structure, but also a divine mandate to establish a center for monotheistic worship in a world that had largely forgotten the essence of true devotion. With unwavering faith, Ibrahim and his son Ismail embarked on the monumental task of constructing the Kaaba. They traveled to the desolate valley of Mecca, a place devoid of water and vegetation, where the starkness of the landscape mirrored the purity of their mission. The Quran narrates that as they laid the foundation stones, they prayed fervently, Our Lord, accept this service from us, for you are the all-hearing, the all-knowing, our Lord. Make of us Muslims bowing to your will, and of our progeny a people Muslim bowing to your will, and show us our places for the celebration of due rights, and turn unto us in mercy, for you are the oft-returning, most merciful. Quran 2, 127, 128. The construction of the Kaaba was an act of profound significance, symbolizing the covenant between Allah and humanity. It was built as a cubical structure, simple and unadorned, yet imbued with immense spiritual depth. The Kaaba was meant to be a focal point for worship, a place where the faithful could turn their hearts and prayers towards, no matter where they were in the world. Its simplicity was a reflection of the purity of monotheism, an unembellished devotion to the singular creator. However, the passage of time and the ebb and flow of civilizations brought changes to the Kaaba. As different tribes and cultures intersected, the sanctity of this holy site was gradually compromised. The people of Mecca, particularly the Quraysh tribe, who were the custodians of the Kaaba, began to place idols and images within its precincts. The Kaaba, once a beacon of pure monotheism, became a repository for a multitude of deities and idols, each representing various aspects of life and nature that people worshipped. The desecration of the Kaaba reached its peak, with hundreds of idols placed within and around the structure. Among these idols was Hubal, the chief deity of the Quraysh, and Alat, Al Uzza, and Manat, the revered goddesses of pre Islamic Arabia. This polytheistic transformation of the Kaaba was a stark departure from the original vision of Ibrahim and Ismail. The sacred sanctuary that was meant to unite humanity in the worship of the one God had become a symbol of fragmentation and spiritual decay. It was in the 7th century CE that the divine purpose of the Kaaba was to be restored. The Prophet Muhammad, a direct descendant of Ibrahim through his son Ismail, emerged as a reformer and a messenger of monotheism. Born into the Quraysh tribe in Mecca, Muhammad was deeply troubled by the rampant idolatry and spiritual corruption that had taken root in his society. At the age of forty, he received the first revelation from Allah through the angel Jibril, Gabriel, marking the beginning of his prophetic mission. For over a decade, Muhammad preached the message of monotheism, calling the people of Mecca to abandon their idols and return to the worship of the one true God. 
his message was met with resistance, hostility, and persecution from the Quraysh, who saw their social and economic power threatened by his teachings. Despite the hardships, Muhammad's faith and determination never wavered. His unwavering commitment to monotheism was a testament to his spiritual lineage and the divine mission entrusted to him. In 622 CE, facing increasing persecution, Muhammad and his followers migrated to the city of Yathrib, later known as Medina. This event, known as the Hijra, marked a turning point in Islamic history. In Medina, Muhammad established a thriving Muslim community and continued to spread the message of Islam. The growing strength and influence of the Muslim community eventually led to a series of conflicts with the Quraysh, culminating in the conquest of Mecca in 630 CE. When Muhammad entered Mecca triumphantly, his first act was to purify the Kaaba. With a heart full of reverence and a spirit ignited by faith, he ordered the removal of all idols from the Kaaba. The Prophet, accompanied by his companions, personally participated in the cleansing of the sacred sanctuary, smashing the idols and erasing the remnants of polytheism. This act was not merely a physical cleansing, but a profound spiritual restoration. It marked the Kaaba's return to its original sanctity, becoming once again a house dedicated solely to the worship of the one true God. The Kaaba, now free of idols, was rededicated as the focal point of Islamic worship. The Prophet Muhammad established the rituals of Hajj and Umrah, annual pilgrimages to the Kaaba that serve as acts of devotion and unity for Muslims worldwide. The Kaaba, once tainted by the presence of idols, now stood in pristine purity, a beacon of monotheism and spiritual renewal. It became the Qibla the direction towards which Muslims turn in prayer, symbolizing the unity of the Ummah, Muslim community, and their unwavering devotion to Allah. The significance of the Kaaba in Islam cannot be overstated. It is not just a physical structure, but a profound symbol of faith, unity, and continuity. Each year, during the Hajj pilgrimage, millions of Muslims from all corners of the earth gather in Mecca, drawn by the magnetic pull of their faith and the desire to fulfill one of the five pillars of Islam. The sight of the Kaaba draped in its black kiswa, covering, surrounded by the throngs of pilgrims, is a powerful testament to the enduring legacy of Ibrahim and the actions of Muhammad. The rituals performed during Hajj, including the tawaf, circumambulation, around the Kaaba, the sa'i, walking between the hills of Safa and Marwa, and the standing at Arafat, all serve to commemorate the trials, faith, and devotion of Ibrahim, Ismail, and Hajar, Hagar. These rituals are a reminder of the profound spiritual heritage that Muslims inherit and the timeless message of monotheism that transcends generations. The story of the Kaaba is a story of faith's triumph over adversity of the enduring power of devotion, and the reclamation of spiritual purity. It is a story that inspires countless believers to strive for a deeper connection with the divine and to uphold the principles of monotheism in their lives. The Kaaba stands as a symbol of the eternal bond between humanity and the Creator, a place where the whispers of prayer and the echoes of devotion resonate through the ages. As we reflect on the journey of the Kaaba, from its construction by Ibrahim and Ismail to its purification by the Prophet Muhammad, we are reminded of the resilience and steadfastness of faith. The Kaaba's transformation from a sanctuary of idols to the holiest site in Islam is a powerful narrative of spiritual renewal and divine grace. It teaches us that no matter how much time passes or how far we stray, the essence of true worship and unity can always be reclaimed, lighting the way for future generations. In the ever-changing landscape of the world, the Kaaba remains a constant, a timeless beacon of hope and inspiration. It calls upon us to remember our spiritual heritage, to honor the legacy of the prophets, and to uphold the principles of monotheism in our lives.
The Kaaba, standing majestically in the heart of Mecca, is a testament to the enduring power of faith, a symbol of unity that transcends borders, and an eternal reminder of the one true God who guides us all.